live from the local station. News 4 Jax starts now. A plea from a local veteran. He wants his lost dogs back after he learned his canine companions were adopted. News for Jackson Twitter, Corley Peel joining us live from outside the man's home in Springfield. Yeah, Corley, we're kind of picking up here. Uh, he didn't get them by adoption. How did he lose his dogs and why can't he get them back? William Batak says that the new owners of the dogs aren't willing to give his dogs back. He says he was on vacation out of state when his dog sitter called him saying that they left this front gate open, allowing the dogs to get out and to never be seen again. William Patak says his five-year-old French poodle named Mignon and his nine-month-old pit bull mix, Saber, are his whole world. I'm a widower. My wife's deceased. They were like my children. On August 7th, he got a call from his dog sitter saying the dogs were missing after leaving the front gate open. Of course, I was I really heartbroken. I still, I'm still looking for the dogs. The tag searched local shelters and the Jacksonville Humane Society, but was unsuccessful at finding his dogs. A woman responded to his Facebook post, saying she saw his dog's pictures on the Jacksonville Humane Society website. The dogs had new names under their pictures, Champion and Athena. Patak returned to the Humane Society to learn two different families adopted his dogs. How did that make you feel? Very heartbroken. I, it was like a brutal blow is what it was. The Humane Society says it has a seven-day holding period for stray animals. Patak says the Humane Society reached out to the adopted families. One family agreed to give one of his dogs back. About an hour before I actually was getting ready to leave, I got a call from the Humane Society saying that the people who adopted my dog, one of the dogs, has reneged and wants to keep the dog. Patak says he's back to square one, heartbroken, living alone without Mignon and Saber. I just hope and pray that these people uh, have a little understanding, you know, and uh, allow me to get my dogs back. A local attorney tells me there's not much Patak can do to get his dogs back. He says the best thing he can do is try to get in touch with those new owners to see if he can buy his dogs back. Patak says he's willing to do whatever it takes to bring his dogs back home. Reporting live from Springfield, Corley PL Channel 4, The Local Station.